Hello guys, I welcome you all on this wonderful platform that is Baiju's exam prep. So first of all, I would like to wish you a very happy new year to all of you as today is 1st January. And guys, I am here today in front of you with an important notification that is going to be from the side of NHPC. And you know, it is a mini Ratna PSU. And I would like to tell you first of all, some important point of this notification so that you get to know whether it is useful for you or not. First thing is this recruitment is only for the branches mechanical, civil and electrical. Second thing is it is a special recruitment drives uh, for the for the backlog post of 2021 year and also 2022. So that is why uh, for these posts only those candidates are eligible who have appeared for gate 2022 and they have the scorecard for gate 2022 and they qualified. And third thing is this is a special recruitment drive for the categories of OBC, SCST and PWBD. It is not for general categories. So these are the categories for which these posts are as they are the empty posts which were there. So it is a special recruitment drive. Okay. So when we are talking about NHPC, it is a mini Ratna company and you know that it is special recruitment drive as I said for SCST, OBC, PWBD candidates for the post of trainee engineer in civil, electrical and mechanical through GATE 2022 score. Now let us see the qualification requirement. So if you have done your BTEC final four years and obviously if you have done it uh, with the GATE score of 2022, you are already pass out student. So they are asking for a 60% marks aggregate and also they are asking that if you are going to apply for the civil engineering, electrical or mechanical, your pay scale would be 50,000 to 160,000. This is a E2 pay uh, grade scale. And you can see 30 years are the uh, age limit for the general category students. So obviously after that you have some uh, relaxation for OBC, SCST candidates. They are saying that if you are applying for civil engineering post, your BTEC should be in civil. If you are applying for a mechanical engineering, for mechanical engineering post, then your BTEC should be in mechanical or production or thermal or mechanical and automation. If you are applying for electrical engineering post, then your BTEC should be in electrical, electrical and electronics, power system and high voltage power engineering. And guys, these are the number of vacancies. They are mentioning that backlog vacancy of recruitment year 21-22 are there and carry forward or resultant vacancy of recruitment year 22-23 are there. So these are the vacancies for 21-22 and 22-23. So that's why they are considering gate 22 scorecard. So they have mentioned these like this star mark vacancies are from 21 backlog and these are from 22. So but overall gate 22 scorecard is uh, eligible for that. So you can see total one post here and 17 here total 18 posts for civil and then 16 posts for electrical and as usual for mechanical 47 vacancies which are highest in number total 89 vacancies are there out of which 8 are for CA accountant officers. Then my dear you can also see. Uh, these are the PWBD uh, details and they are also category wise PWBD classification like category A, B, C, D and E. And guys now we are coming to some very important things of the notification which are related to person uh, okay which are related to compensation package. I already told you 50,000 to 160,000 E2 grade and this will be during the training period. And they are saying that this will be comprising of basic pay, dearness allowance, HRA, cafeteria allowance, performance related uh, pay, medical facility, social security benefits. They all PF, pension, gratuity all are going to be there. And they are also mentioning that after one year of training, uh, on successful completion of training, the candidate will be absorbed as engineer or officer in the same scale with probation of one year. The total annual emoluments for the new joinee shall be approximately 15 lakhs. CTC is 15 lakh, which is a very attractive package. Placements will be at projects, power station, offices, including joint ventures and subsidiary companies of NHPC. Then for trainee engineer, we are talking about, they are saying whatever the gate marks after normalization you get out of 100. Why normalization? Because maybe two paper codes would, two papers would be there for some branch. So for that they will be having normalized score and out of 100. So they are just asking for gate score, nothing else, no written test, no interview, no GD uh, PI. So you can say everything is based on the gate score only. So gate 22 score is the whole soul on which on the basis of which selection will happen. And they are saying that like for mechanical and electrical post various branches are eligible. But if you are applying for civil post, your gate paper code should be civil only. 
if you are applying for mechanical post your gate paper code should be mechanical only your btech may be from these branches similarly for electrical only electrical paper code are eligible so that is the point that's why i always say if you are looking for more opportunity then even your btech is in some other branch then mechanical should be the uh, eligible so that's why you should appear in gate from mechanical for mechanical and other branch students okay so then we are talking about the other important things other important things are uh, reservation and relaxation as per the government norms and they are also mentioning the age relaxation will be 5 years for scst 3 years for obc and then 13 years for pwbd obc 10 years for pwbd general 15 years for pwbd scst and upper age limit relaxed by 5 years for the candidate who had ordinary been domiciled in state of jammu and kashmir and guys next we are moving to the other things that is related to service agreement so if you are going to complete a minimum of 4 years of service then it's fine but if you are going to leave before 4 years of service you need to pay 250000 because that will be the bond amount for general ews or obc categories for other categories the bond would be of 125000 rupees then my dear how to apply you will be going to the official website there they will be asking you from the gate 22 score gate 22 registration number and all the details okay then my dear they are also mentioning that ki you would be able to apply from 2nd january to 22nd of january 22nd of january by 6 pm after that you cannot apply then they are also mentioning all those things what are the documents required photograph and all everything is mentioned here then my dear here also the same details similar details you can see that application registered with invalid gate 22 score card will be rejected medical fitness would also be required medical test would be there after the uh, provisional selection then you can see they are also mentioning all other important things uh, related to uh, the general information and instructions so here they are mentioning a important thing candidates are advised to keep their email id active for one year no change in email id will be allowed once entered all future correspondence of appointment etc shall be done through the email only responsibility of receiving downloading and printing of information communication etc will be of the candidates nhpc will not be responsible for any loss because of that okay so change of email id will not be entitled or entertained then you can also see start date for submission is 2nd january last date of submission is 22nd january 6 pm so guys this was the notification i will share it with you guys on my telegram channel mechanical by dheeraj sardana and guys just subscribe this channel so that you can get all the notifications on time we are coming up with all important notifications on time also we are providing you uh, guidance from the starting to the end even after selection we are always there to you uh, there with you and before you know that like for isro also mock tests are going on for gate also marathons are already planned so you guys would be getting entire content for mechanical civil xc production industrial all those things from on this channel and notification related to every branch would be there on this channel so just stay tuned with us and you will be getting benefited so goodbye guys for this particular video and all the best